YouTube, 2B12359 here, bringing to you guys another video on an application for Terraria, which is called T-Edit, otherwise known as TEDIT. Um, what this application allows you to do is, it allows you to um, edit your worlds in Terraria. So you obviously need Terraria, and you're going to need T-E-Edit, um, T-Edit, the address of, for the website download will be in the description. Let's open that up. Alright, so here this is what you get once you open once you open up the application and you go to uh, load world if you want to open a world just do world one. As you can see rendering world and it's loading it right here and there is the world. So um yeah, so this can also be used as a world viewer. As you can see, there's you can see everything here. Um, and to edit things, all you do is simply select a paintbrush or a pencil. I'm going to use the brush. And enable painting tiles. So right now, I'm going to paint dirt. You can select it right here. Dirt. And as you can see, I'm painting all of that into dirt. So I practically covered all the... All the chat... Like, all the... Yeah, all the caves and stuff, and it's all covered completely with dirt. And I could change it into, for example, gold. Hold on, let me just select gold. And painting the floor gold. Alright, um, so I'll show you guys that it actually works in a, in, in a little bit, but first I want to show you a really cool um, add-on. So, let me just find it. There it is. So, a cool thing you can do is view w what's inside of a chest. So if I use the arrow tool right here, and I look for a little, a little square that's golden, and I click on it with the arrow tool, it'll open up this. So chest contents, magic mirror, wooden arrow, lesson here, lesser healing potion, and a torch. I could also change what's inside of it in the empty slots. Or I can just leave it empty. I'm gonna leave it empty because I practically have everything. Um, and it to the right here, there's world properties. You can change your world name. You can change whether it's a blood moon or not. Um, you can change the moon phase. You could select whether the Eye of Cthulhu is dead, whether the Eater of Worlds is dead, or Skeletron is dead. Um, so practically, if you killed Skeletron and you want to verse him again, you just uncheck that, and the old man will appear in the dungeon. You can also change the time of day. And yeah, uh, that's pretty much it for the application. Um, now just to show you guys that it actually works. So once you're done and you know, once you're done with everything and you have everything you want, just press save world and save the world. Close that. Go into, ter into my terraria. Turn down the volume. Alright, so just give me a couple of seconds to get there. And don't pay attention to the crappy, yeah, crappy, um, buildings. Because this is my very first world that I created in Terraria. Tried to make it as good as possible, but I guess it didn't work out. Here's my crappy village. Okay, almost there. And there you have it. The floor is all completely gold. Um, trees obviously don't go on, grow on gold, so yeah. <laughs> this is all what I just did. Um, and yeah, guys, I uh, hope you found this video useful or helpful. Um, be sure to rate, comment, and subscribe. And yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Peace.